Okay, so let's move on to the action plan now. What was the overall score on the quiz? 94.2. Wow. <laughs> nice job. That's great. So do, will you do whole class modeling? Like what do you, what's your action plan to address the issue? Um, I will not do whole class modeling because that would only leave a, a couple students in each class that did not gain Get mastery. It. So yeah. because they all have it and they did so well. Yeah, so I won't do guided discourse either. Okay. So where, how will you ensure that the, the few students who missed it um, get that gap closed? Um, and because there's so few in each class, looking at my two blocks, I'm not going to pull an intervention yet. I think we'll add it into the spiral, and okay. I'll just make sure I'm monitoring those couple students who missed this on the quiz. And in instructional and design, I think I'll go into my spiral and add a note that I need to make sure that I'm mm -hmm. representing improper fractions. Okay. I wonder, too, if the fact that they were all correct tripped them up. I so bet, maybe yeah. putting a note in about that, that, that it's okay. Sometimes they're all correct. Right, and I can start adding that into my Socratives, too. Just Right. Okay, so can you write down your action plan at the bottom? Okay, so I'm going to make a note that in my spiral I need to represent improper fractions more often. Um, I'm going to, in my instructional design, um, so add, put the note in, or add your note. Yeah, and then possibly in my Socrative's. Mm -hmm. You'll do, uh, have a all, question every now and then where all are correct. And then I would also note down to talk with your SGI and make sure she has the same strategies and expecting the same thing that you are when they go there. 